I talk about this in the book. There's a line that says, you will always find the evidence for what you choose to believe. And if you look at beliefs in general, you know, ideas are meant to be elastic as well. <laughs> They're meant to be explored. Um, but if an idea becomes an ideology, then the ideology literally can become a part of your identity. And if it becomes, if an idea becomes your identity, then for you to change your mind, a part of you has to die. And that's why people will do anything. They will actually kill and die over ideas without looking at any other evidence. And I think, you know, to your point about masculinity, um, there's this survival thing, you know, like we hunt, and we survive, you know, and all of the, and you, you almost like are tricking yourself into thinking that your ideas are a part of your survival mechanism. Fuck yeah. Like, like they're fight or flight, like, you know, and um, they're not. And once you even have the acknowledgement and the awareness that they're not, at least a little bit of space opens up. You might not stop that trigger of wanting to defend yourself to the death, you know, but you at least know that it's imaginary. It's really completely imaginary. Um, and so I think there's a lot of power in uh, coming to that understanding. Yeah, and, I, and, and, for, and for those listening right now, if that's starting to stir something up in you that doesn't feel comfortable, that's that's good. That's information. That's showing, I would say, that's showing you where you're not quite free right now. And so that's an opportunity to go into that identity and look at it for what it is and see how it's served you up till now and how long or how it's maybe no longer serving you and and do the work because it is... I know you've done the work. I've been doing the work. As we start to peel away these identities and to disassociate from them and to thank them for what they've done for us, in the beginning, man, it's terrifying because that's all we really know are the all these masks that we put on that we, you know, we build ourselves up and we show up in all these different ways in all these different situations. And we think that's what we have to do. Well, it becomes very confusing when you have different people around and you're supposed to be different ways with different people. And, and really, the, probably the, the, biggest, the biggest message that's come through for me lately is to just show up as me. 